Police are giving us an inside look into what happened moments before an officer shot a suspect as he was approaching police with a knife in one hand and a hammer in the other on Wednesday in a trailer park. And today, Fairfield Township police releasing 911 calls, body cam video, and even cruiser cam video showcasing what exactly took place. The incident began when the mother of 29 year old Brian Hubbard called Crisis Care, who's been working with Hubbard for a while. The Crisis Care worker then called police when the situation sounded tense. When officers arrived at the home, Hubbard's mother warned officers outside that her son may be aggressive towards police. Minutes later, Hubbard is seen walking towards police holding a six to eight inch butcher knife in one hand and a hammer in the other. Numerous times, officers asked Hubbard to put the weapons down, but he continued to walk towards police and that's when he was shot. Hubbard is seen walking inside his home with gunshot wounds and that's when he was tackled to the ground by an officer treated and then rushed to the hospital where he's still recovering. Police have been called to this address numerous times. The chief says Hubbard previously threatened to burn down his house, hurt his mother and even hurt himself. Since BCI is conducting a criminal investigation, I can only go so far as to uh, you know what I said about the officers. There's no doubt that what that their performance is, is within policy uh, and training. No officers were injured in this shooting. Fairfield Township Police have an arrest warrant out for Hubbard on two counts of felonious assault. Reporting live, Rachel Hersheimer, WLWT News.